hey guys welcome back to another weekly vlog actually this is for the last two weeks um so i started this vlog by visiting beauty space i needed to get my hair done i just got home from beauty space and this is the hairstyle i went with um you've probably seen this hairstyle but now in a different uh, color I used to do number 33 but this time I decided to do 133 um, and it has Spanish on it so I need to actually order the Oz braid polisher so that they don't tangle and because uh, uh, they usually she can load this hairstyle if you don't have that braid polisher so I need to order it tomorrow so tomorrow we are heading to Moranga for work and uh, I had to order two new jeans these people have delivered the wrong color of jeans I ordered for black and navy blue anyways um, they'll still have to do because now I don't have a choice um, I wanted black because you know black um, someone may not be sure if it's jeans you're wearing or khaki you're wearing so i got uh two of them i wanted black i didn't want this color and this navy blue this one they got it right um so i got this navy blue and black so i want to put them in the washer right now um because i want to wear one tomorrow the other one on friday so um before I do that, I got a package from Treasured Scent and I love packages, invitations that come with gifts. So they're having a, they're having a sensory, yeah, a sensory like function um, on Saturday. So this is how the invitation came. So let me just open it. I love invitations. And the box just smells amazing, guys. It smells so nice. So this is the invitation. Sorry, it's bent. Um, it's an invitation from Treasured Scent. If you don't know what tre who Treasured Scent, Scent are, they usually uh, make, they usually sell bath and body works, candles, lotion, shower gels, the whole thing. So this is invisible yet unforgettable accessory let me just open so the invitation is um the sensory soiree hey by treasured scent so it's at greenhouse mall um yeah so basically it will be like wine tasting um just something that candles and especially candles the, from the gift bun um, so how did she describe it so these are the gifts that they sent first they sent sorry let me just they sent this set of candles from the gift bun the, the heels um, so this one is a signature collection it smells like candy and they all have different scents. Let me just open them. So this one is Summer Days. Oh, smells really amazing. And then we have Spring Waters. Oh, I kid you not, guys. This one's even better than Bath and Body Works. Honestly. And to think they're made in Kenya. Hand powered in Kenya. Hand powered in Kenya. The hill so this one is called island dreams oh, this one feels like it's more of um like the bathroom uh for your bathrooms and shower area and loose and then this one oh my gosh spring water feels like more of the bedroom oh, this one the living room oh, summer days i need to order this i need to order I hope they have like a bigger version of these some things. So yeah, that's the first package. Um, the second package. I don't know what they've they've sprayed on this, but it smells so nice. It 
smells nice. I don't know what it is, but the box smells really nice. <laughs> nice. So um, the other one is a linen luxury room and linen spray from the gift bun. So this is how it looks. Let me just show you before I unbox it. And then, so this one is the uh, Scent Thousand Wishes. A luxury room and linen spray. It just smells like the A Thousand Wishes from Bath and Body Works. Oh, hand poured in Kenya, shake well before use. Oh, this is so nice. Maybe we're getting ready to go, eh? Eh? Not as Dej Baka lipstick. We are getting we, ready to go see Rain and Sun. Nimem disinfect na detol. Eh, I mean, you know, 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 I Eh, yeah. I mean, but I need. Nani, are you Nani, are you cutting? 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 Nani, are I can't wait for you. I can't wait for you. I can't I I I Nice jeans as a jacket or pocket. A tea flash toothbrush, a kawacha. You kitty gonna smell. What a kamish mesh. I don't a mesh mesh. Glitters. A kissy jacula. I'll take you quick attack a dog. Doku jacula. Sandals. Yeah. You can wear sandals. Yeah. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not which one looks better? Brown. Brown. Like when you look at to our sandals, I just can get the dog shoes. Nigga, you could pay you and the less hassle. Actually, Nikona are black. By the to exchange, and where are you going to get another black? Minich quite brown. You can't let all the young we Oh, eh, hey, brown. I mean, I'm not going to be black. You're not going to be messy. 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 You're not
I'm not a lipstick person. Hairy lip gloss. Okay, what are you doing? I'm doing a baby kit. Okay. What are you doing? I'm doing a black. I'm doing a black. I'm doing a silver. I'm doing a silver. I'm doing a silver. I'm doing a silver. I'm doing a rubber shoes. I'm doing a silver. I'm doing a silver. Oh, this is less a white and silver. Yeah. So today is Saturday, we are currently at Greenspan Mall with my sister, so this is the treasured scent uh, shop, so I thought I'd just take you guys through on what um, they have in stock, all the bath and body works um, scents they have, candles, lotions, shower gels, body scrub, lip glosses, the list is endless, car diffusers, um, the list is just endless, you have to really visit the shop and just get um, a glimpse of everything that's here. So we are waiting for the setup for the sensory soiree to be done. So I just uh, thought I should just like see if there's any new scent that I can take. I'm used to champagne toast when it comes to Bath & Body Works. So I needed to sample and get a different scent of something, which I did. I'm going to show you guys way later on. So like i said we were just waiting for the sensory sorry setup to be done and then uh, we actually went to the car and had pizza we had lunch <laughs> there so basically what the sensory sorry is what they did is they combined um a few businesses so those are saxophonist <laughs> okay there was music there was um what is it called wine tasting those food tasting those now the scents which are the candles and the lotions and the car diffusers and aromas those very beautiful jazz music playing you'll see that in a few there was there's just a lot of activity so the bandari beauty was also there they were doing consultations on skincare uh products and everything so it was a whole um afternoon of just you know taking in a lot uh, unfortunately for me i had to leave very early because i had another uh family function i had a very big family function <laughs> uh that day so i had to go my son and my hubby were already there so i left my sisters there to just enjoy the day but it was really really beautiful I actually told them they need to do this again uh bigger and better because this was such a great idea just uh sipping your wine listening to good music sampling uh, amazing lotions and candles and scents and just it was such a beautiful afternoon
turn left to turn right or look straight at the sun my mind's gone in circles i'm trying to fight it getting these voices inside to stay quiet going to the place where all this began to start again oh you won't see the light until the dawn breaks no till it's all said and done you won't He's going to wake up any time now, so we just chill here in the car with him. Good afternoon, guys. So, quick one I wanted to uh, remind you guys that Emos Properties is back with their Christmas gifts. Um, you know, they usually do this every year for clients who buy property during this Christmas festive season, and they usually gift clients a variety of things. So, um if you buy property with the most this festive season or this Christmas season, one, you stand a chance to either be gifted a whole mbuzi, good, and you know how expensive mbuzis have become these days, uh, so you'll be gifted a mbuzi for Chrissy, either a glass, a gas cylinder, shopping voucher, and air ticket, a free air ticket for those who want to go view the Malindi properties. So, um, the properties that are currently on the christmas gift um what is it called package is the tumaini sorry it's a tumaini gardens uh in makutano which is going for 480,000 for a 50 by 100 and there's also baraka gardens in malindi i think i've mentioned baraka gardens so many times in my vlog which is going for 150,000 for a 50 by 100 and there's the last and lastly the sun view estate in matu which is going for 289,000 um for 50 by 100 so i will attach a number on the screen where you can call them to either book a site visit um they usually do site visits um they have a very comfortable van that you can go with so i'll attach a number here where you can book a site visit with then you go see either of the properties that i've mentioned and then um also i don't think they are doing malindi this year i think malindi is still it's up it's up to next year um because they did the last malindi trip i think um in november or yeah, I think in November and I think I mentioned it here so some went for the last Malindi trip so I just wanted to remind you guys that uh, anyone who invests with the most properties this December you stand a chance to win the list that I've given you guys so again I always end by saying do your due diligence uh, do your search uh, ask for the mother titles get your advocates involved uh, follow the due process before um, jumping into any any kind of investment always do your research first and yeah get background information on everything and just ask around about information of what you want to do so yeah um they're located in jewel complex along thicker road on fourth floor in case you want to physically go visit them so that's what i wanted to remind you guys about mm -hmm. So today we didn't have lights uh, since morning so we decided just to go out for a family lunch and my son clearly did not like this place. He was so fussy you can see the table we didn't even eat our food. <laughs> we had to be uh, to leave and just have it all packed for us. So next day I went to Lux Nils Parlor for a pedicure and today I got the 
the new pedicure which is called uh, LNP which is Lux Nails Parlor World at Your Feet Pedicure and I'm telling you guys this pedicure lived up to its name where I found my new favorite uh, pedicure from Lux um, the massage the foot soak on the gel you'll see later on um, they do this gel foot soak with hot water that was my favorite favorite part I felt so relaxed so this is one pedicure guys honestly if you've not been to Lux please just make an appointment and go to Lux and either get this one or the other one that I usually get so once um, they do the pedicure they do the nails and everything they scrub your feet you just spend like the next 30 minutes just soaking your feet and getting a nice massage where I've never felt this relaxed this one this one lacks you hit the jackpot this pedicure is really really awesome you'll see um in the end like they were massaging me with this uh, metal ball it was actually um warm a bit warm hotish so it even made the massage really really awesome the foot soak this gel foot soak is just everything plus the other foot soak that you're going to see and the massage again oh i don't even know how to explain to you guys this was an exceptional christmas treat for me um this is something that i'll highly advise if you want to gift someone something someone says someone special get them the lux watcher so that they can come and get this uh, pedicure done. Hey guys, so I just got back home. Um, by the way, I'm on leave. Did I mention I'm on leave? It's starting today till um, the second week of January. I'm hoping to get a lot of content done uh, by the time I resume back to work. <laughs> I also have a lot of content backed up um, that I've not done. Uh, last week was just hectic. I was all over. So um i just got home from lux and these are the nails i had done so we went with the christmas theme obviously really love them i've ever put this green before i think it was either last not last year yeah last year sometime last year i think i've ever put i put this green so i'll show you the fit in the next clip so as you can see my room is extremely messy it's dusty it's and a huge load of laundry uh, staring at me right now um i usually do our uh, laundry on sundays and as you all know yeah yesterday there was no lights anywhere i have a ton of uh, packages that i want to open so i want to open them before I clean the room so that I can clean as I organize everything that's inside the packages. So the first thing I got was a PR gift from, not a PR gift, is a gift from Glam Access. Uh, the page that I usually buy my heels and my flats. So they sent me two pairs of shoes. So the first pair is these flats. So it's just like a thank you for mentioning them in my channel. So this is the first pair that they sent me. I'm hearing like my machine has an error. And this is the first pair they sent me. Nice flats are uh, open, open to at the top um, and at the bottom, I mean on the side. And then the other uh, pair of heels they, they, they sent, the other pair of shoes they sent was this beige shoe. You see how I'm datifying the place. This is what I'm avoiding to do. 
uh, after I've cleaned. So they sent these uh, beige heels. You all know I have the black of this one. So when I saw the beige of this one, the nude of this one or beige, whatever, I really I was honestly obsessed. And these heels are super, super comfortable. So thank you so much, Glam Access, for these ones. Really, really, really love them. Love the black. Definitely we love the the nude version of them and I can also wear them with so many things so the next package that I got this is the next package that I got from the Mays German cosmetic shop where I usually get my Balea shower gels and it's a Christmas uh, gift she always does this every year this check is so extra so this is how the package looks like so let me just open um everything one by one i show you what's inside there. so the first thing is this oh is it a tinkerbell it's like a i don't even know what to say this one is it's dressed like father christmas <laughs> so this is how um it looks i think i'm going to put this either in my son's room or in our console this is so sweet and cute ah, the next thing she got me a christmas uh tree deco balls i have three other deco balls that are in my christmas tree i never missed to put them ever since she got me so i'm going to add this to there at this rate my christmas tree will just be full of her things and then she also got me a candle oh this is so beautiful so this is woody spice a woody spice scent this one i'm going to put it in my hubby's man cave my hubby has a uh, a man cave in our house so i think i'm going to put this candle inside or in our room because i have this uh black vibe going on in the room so i'll think about where i'll put this one and then of course she gifted me balea buttermilk and lemon if you're watching this irene i moved to the passion fruit one i love the passion fruit one <laughs> I'd really love to get that one uh, again and then there's l'oreal uh, men expert um, shower gel this one and then there is uh, i don't know what this is honestly okay i'll ask her what this is and then i'll link it <laughs> somewhere here yeah. and then she also got me the balea oh this is a new one oh, this is a new set let's see smells really lovely it smells like strawberries and chocolate combined the next thing she sent me was a Garnier uh, face mask this one and then there's a Balea 0% aluminium deodorant and then there is chocolates here Merry Christmas chocolates I'm going to put them add them in my chocolate jar and then there's a card oh. My memory is done. Let me delete some videos then come back. This is how it looks. Oh, this is so thoughtful. Really, really thoughtful. Hey, Maggie, you're a gift in my life and not um, the kind I'd return for store credit. <laughs> Merry Christmas, best wishes, Irene, the Miss German store. Oh, this is so cute. <laughs> oh, nice one. Uh huh. Next, oh, this is a nice basket. She also she always gives uh, gifts in such nice uh, baskets that you can actually reuse for a lot of things. And then there is, I'm guessing this is a Christmas candy. Also, I'm just going to put them in my uh, Christmas drawer at this rate. All of them, and then she sent me an advent calendar. So this is the advent calendar i think she also sent me one like this last year and it was really 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 nice i really really love that I, you remember i got an invite to attend the treasured scent uh sensory soiree so we went for it it was really really amazing i couldn't stay for long because i had um another family function i think i've mentioned that but on my way out i passed by treasured scent and i got a few things so the first thing i got was this uh vanilla this vanilla bean um noel moisturizing body wash 
um really love this scent thank next to champagne toast i think this is my next favorite scent from bath and body works i also got the champagne toast like i said i love the bath and body works champagne toast i also got its body wash really really love the champagne toast so i also got the scrub for it honestly i also got the scrub for it this one has a bit of shimmer in it so it's an exfoliating glow body scrub so it has a bit of shimmer in it so i got the shower wash and the scrub for it and then i got um two last things i got does this thing keep falling down i got a lip gloss also from but then body works i love their lip glosses they usually smell really really nice so this one is mag magenta mint uh it has a bit of mint and a lip a bit of lip tint to it and then the last thing that i got is the car diffuser car aroma diffuser so this one you just stick it to the dashboard of your car i'll show you guys once i do that i've actually uh, passed from the car wash on my way home so my car is really really clean i went to palmia um oh, for those who are asking about directions for palmia car wash so let me just explain it to you guys you see um the junction for kiambu road you have bypass you have kiambu road and you have bypass so once you okay let's say you're coming from from cbd um facing kiambu town so you're coming from cbd once you get to that bridge you divert uh for this bypass as if you're going to two rivers um so you'll take the bypass as if you're going to two rivers or where else yeah you can only mention two rivers like you're going to two rivers once you get to that bypass you won't even go far the car wash is literally on your right it's called pamia you won't even go far you won't miss it it's green and the name is written in red um so it will be on your right if you're coming from the bypass uh side maybe you're coming from two rivers Roaka to rivers that way you're coming up now to join the bridge or the bypass for or going up bypass or going to Kiambu Road. Just after you've passed the new hotel that is being built, you've passed Gidongoro Road, you've passed the new hotel, it's right there. You also won't miss it. Really, really amazing Kawash. They do such a good job. So um this is how the the car diffuser looks like. So this is a diffuser you stick it to the dashboard. It comes with a a cable for charging and it comes with the diffuser itself so this the diffuser i went with um the aroma that i went with was shin what is this shangli shangli yeah. that's the name of the uh diffuser that i went with shangli Shang Shanglira and they have also the Chanel one was really really nice but I think I preferred the scent of this one to the Chanel one for some reason I don't know why and I am a Chanel girl yeah I actually preferred this but though I hope they will really come up with like more better sweeter scents like the Bath and Body Works that one will really really work well I'm actually thinking of once this is over I'll put like a Bath and Body Works scent inside <laughs> just to see how it is so i'll put like a bath and body work scent inside just to see how it is but this is how the the car aroma diffuser comes in and this one i think is going for 3600 um all the rest of the other things i showed you was going between either 2300 to 2500 yeah where is my son crying So anyway, um, so I think that's it for the packages that I got. Oh, we passed by Wa Wa Waikiki yesterday. Uh, my son is being baptized um, this week. So I had to pick like an outfit for him from Waikiki. And I don't know why. Um, I know 
baby girls have the cutest outfits out there but when it comes to baby boys it's like no one is bothered to get like nice cute things for baby boys so we really struggle getting an outfit for him at uh, Waikiki I know Waikiki really has some nice cute uh, baby boy stuff but we really really struggle especially um, this age of 12 months to 18 months so this is what uh, we got for him I just stumbled upon an outfit I think someone had hidden the shirt <laughs> and I just stumbled upon it at Waikiki so we got it we got him some uh, shorts because it's really really um, sunny of late and this one will be more like a three quarter to him and then I also got him a linen shirt with a bow tie let me just remove the tag got him a linen shirt with a, a bow tie in it so this will be like his really cute outfit for the day so this is how it be so the only thing i didn't get was shoes i'm going to go to mr price tomorrow as, as i also look for like a bras for myself i need some bras um so i'm just going to get um this one's from, I'm hoping I'll get at Mr. Price and he also we also got him some cute uh, crocs from Waikiki. Right now he's actually learning to walk. He's walking a lot so we just got him crocs and he likes throwing his what is it called? Throwing his um ah, I didn't know he had gotten anti sleep socks. This set he likes removing his socks and throwing them away so i also got him this pair of socks um so i have actually discovered that uh two of the socks comes with this anti-slip um things that help him not slide on the floor so two of them come with that anti-slip and the other ones are just normal but i also had gotten these ones which are anti-slip ones and they're really really warm these ones so yeah um also socks wise i had to really struggle before getting these two sets of socks so i don't know what's happening with waikiki when it comes to baby boys uh, but anyway i'll have to go and look if also if i get like a trouser before then for this shade because i want him and the dad to wear matching outfits and then for me i'll just figure it out what <laughs> What are we about him and the dad? I want them to have this matching outfit. The dad already has this uh, color combination already in a khaki trouser and a white shirt. So for him, he didn't have. Um, so I will have to go back to Mr. Price and look for those. So let me just arrange this room, uh, sort the laundry. Uh, so my room clearly has not been cleaned or organized in the past one week like i said i've been up and down uh, i've been working out of town the past two or three weeks uh, so i haven't had really the time to actually clean it properly but today finally i got everything done so i just stripped the bed i had already washed the duvet uh, the duvet covers and all the pillow covers as you can see they don't have any covers in them so i had already washed them so right now I'll just change the bed sheets and put them back on so my duvet and all the throw pillow covers you see there are all from smart lady homes i usually get asked that question a lot so i was just organizing and clearing all my products then make the bed then the other mess was my uh, on top of my chest of drawers was also really really messy i had to clear out that area it's just because a dumping ground for everything so i cleared it uh wiped it um and also moved to my dressing table which is always a mess <laughs> i'm always um cluttering that space so i finally just cleared it all um cleaned it disinfected all the products with wipes and then returned them back as you can see also the bedside table lamps went um they actually i, I sold them like the next day so 
I'm actually thinking of whether to just replace them or just do an entire room makeover because I really don't want I, I'm, I'm really not a fan of this bed <laughs> one because I can't move it myself to clean um, I have to uh, like wait for my hubby to come and move it it's really 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 heavy so anytime I want to clean like under it or behind it or the headboard behind the headboard I have to wait for him to come and push it so that I can clean it so I was actually thinking should I just do an entire bedroom makeover and just get all new furniture or just just buy the bed, bedside lamps and just call it a day anyway I'm still thinking about that but uh, finally I got this space done uh, but I don't know I'm, I think I'm getting bored of how the room looks like <laughs> Uh, this is usual me. I, I usually do this. I don't know why. So, um, I'll th I'll figure it out. Whether I'll just do an entire bedroom makeover or just um, buy the lamps and just call it a day.
searching for a longer day People feeling like the light has just come We must never stop the way yeah. Birds jumping and I hear my name Grasping into a life Life is happy but it's so insane We must merely make a stride Savannah I'm coming home Savannah We'll never be alone Savannah Um, good morning guys so today is my son's birthday sorry there's a lot of background noise i think that people um talking about the perimeter wall anyway uh today is my son's birthday uh but you're not going to be celebrating his birthday today we're going to do it the day after tomorrow uh because he's being baptized the day after tomorrow and um since the entire extended family is coming for the baptism we thought uh, let's not have two separate events let's just combine both of them so we're going to combine his birthday but he's going to be at his grandparents place oh he's already woken okay up just when i'm picking the camera um it's going to be at his grandparents uh place the birthday the baptism it's um a church in shags so that one we'll deal with it then i'll show you guys um that right now i want to go to uh, i want to go to adley furnitures these people are loud i want to go to adley furnitures it's past Ruaka town before you get to two rivers so they they were making for me the couch for my balcony area so i just want to go see how it is um take a video of some of the furnitures they have in the shop and then my hubby will come later on to pick it up i don't think that seat can fit in my car but we'll see if it will fit in my car i'll come with it if not my hubby will just have to come in with it uh later on so I'm going there. I'll stop by there. I'll mm -hmm. uh, show you guys um, the different furnitures they have in their shop as I see how my seat is going. I went to the two-seater, a very small seat because I didn't want to cover the entire area again, the entire balcony, and then we eat up on the space for my son to walk around and play. So I decided to go with a very small seat that will be facing the other side, the other way, not the way this other one was facing. So let me actually go to the front balcony and show you guys how the balcony looks like. So as you can see we added the tough grass on my balcony. This is a working project progress by the guys. Um it's not even halfway done. We just did the first part which is adding the grass. I just needed somewhere for my son to just be walking and playing. I still need to buy more planters. I need to get rid of this old chair because uh, it will just be rained on and it will become a health hazard here so i just need to buy more potted plants rearrange it really really well and then um i think that one i'll do in like the next few vlogs i'll be showing you guys the update of this balcony i think it even needs a repaint at this rate so i'm at atli furnitures um to see if my uh, balcony couch will fit on in my car which uh, it it cooled in so I had to wait for my hubby to come and pick it so I decided to show you guys the furnitures that they have here most of these things have already been sold but um, they can custom make for you in case you see anything interesting here they can custom make for you I love this couch guys I love 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 this couch I even took photos of it just to just remind me this couch has springs it's really really comfortable honestly if you found it in someone's house and they tell you they custom made it I wouldn't have believed it looks like something from a stall it's so comfortable like just the ones you see on this high-end uh, shop so these are some of the furnitures that were there 
um, I thought I'd just show you guys their work it's really amazing very neat and well detailed So I'm from the Adli Furniture Shop and whoa, guys, you've seen the couch that I've shown you guys, the beige one, it has springs. Do you know how hard it is to get someone who can custom make for you a couch with springs? We've been looking for it and we've not found and this, that one actually has already been sold and it's going for 210, which for me, it's a bargain. That couch is huge, guys, and it's so comfortable. I've sat on it and honestly i cannot believe it uh, i really want to change my couch right now like honestly that couch is so comfortable so they've said they can custom make for you um any uh what is it called any size and uh design that you want um i always thought that if you want like spring those spring cushion you have to buy like from the furniture shops which are really really expensive but these guys are affordable that one is affordable so uh obviously that uh balcony seat for my balcony won't fit in my car so i'll have to wait for my hubby to come and pick it so let me just give you direction on where this shop is i'm outside the shop and it's right it's right it's right opposite total um this is total for rocker um you see there's the what is it called chicken house papaya eh? pepinos uh the chicken house there and then there's a po total petrol station and then on this side you're going to to rivers on this side you're going to rocker town so it's literally opposite this petrol station you'll see the shop you'll see the ugly shop i really love how they're making their furniture um the stitching is just and i love the two tiny details they put on the couches that get the two tiny designs on the uh couches i really love this place we need a bigger house so I can get that big couch. <laughs> it's really, really nice. Oh my gosh. That one has already been sold, but you can custom make one for yourself. I think that's either a 12-seater or something. It's really, really huge. That couch is huge. Anyway, let me go to Two Rivers. I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs> hey, so I just wanted to quickly share what I got from Mr. Praise. I didn't get what I was going there for, and that is bras. Um, and that was like my only hope <laughs> of getting the comfortable bras. So it, I, honestly, at this uh, rate, I don't know what I'm going to do. So, of course, I didn't walk away empty handed. I got a few things. I got um, this lovely dress, and what made me pick this dress was it has pockets. <laughs> <laughs> you'll know me with pockets and then it has this really beautiful uh sleeves that just go till here it's it's baggy okay i'll show you the day i'll wear it how it looks but it's really really cute it's buttoned up uh top to bottom very comfortable and the funny thing is this is size um small so if you're getting this dress i highly advise uh fitting it first because I usually wear large for Mr. Price uh, clothes, but this one is a small and it fits very, very perfectly. So that's the first thing that I got. The second thing that I got were, um, they're not bralettes, they are, what are they called, spark tops. Uh, first of all, there's this uh, top that I saw on my way out. Uh, and it was on sale. It was going for only 300 shillings. I love how the I hope this is this is the front part i thought this is the back part oh my gosh uh, this one i'm not going to wear it anywhere anyway this is the front part i actually thought that this is like the back design of the top that's why i picked it <laughs> now honestly where am i going to wear this uh the back part would have made sense with the jeans but i still can convert it and wear the open part uh, to be the back part so it's a really cute uh, crop top and then i got two three um spark tops i know i don't know what they're called these days uh, as 90s kids we call them spark tops so i got this white one 
with a bit of a lace trim all round and if you can see it very clearly then it has this um detail at the bottom really really love um, the design of this white one i got a blue one they're so comfortable as in on days that you just don't feel like wearing bras so i got this lovely blue one you see what i'm saying there's pack tops <laughs> uh, but they're crop tops and then i got this double strapped uh white one also uh, spaghetti like crop topish i just wish they were like padded but come to think of it i can just buy the the paddings i can just wear this comfortably because they are so comfortable these ones are so comfortable you can just wear them like uh, and put a blouse on or a dress on the way i used to wear my my bralettes before they decided not to fit me so my balcony couch is here and as you can see Otis has already called dibs on it <laughs> it's really comfortable the couch as you can see the cushion is really thick and it's so soft and so comfortable really love it plus it's heavy it was made of really uh, good quality wood the woodwork was done really really well i actually thinking of painting this table here to match that couch um so the size is just perfect it's so comfortable for me uh and i'm happy to sit on and also my son my son has actually been playing a lot here you can see how the cats have taken over this balcony so like i said this is all a work in progress guys i'll keep you updated on how the balcony setup will be finally but this is just temporary for now but i wanted to plug you guys on adley furnitures they really did a good 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 job with the balcony seat So TechFab came uh, today to install my outdoor cameras and I can tell you guys I've used their cameras for like two days. Actually the same same day I just told them they need to come and change my indoor ones. Theirs are way way better. So these are the features that come with the cameras. They are waterproof, they have night vision, they rotate 360. So we, we thought we were actually going to like install many but we only ended up installing two because they could rotate and just come cover the entire compound the way we wanted so i'm just going to show you guys a screen recording of the app where um the app for the camera so that you can see how um like the the view of the cameras is but these cameras are some quality has equal to per network and my cameras my indoor ones zero to per network sana so these ones they didn't and it was raining so badly like the other day and i could just peep uh usiku and i can see the cameras are working perfectly you can rotate them um to whatever view that you want and clearly my house needs a bit of paint work <laughs> on the outdoor so i'll organize for that for now uh, that's a project for another day so they did an amazing amazing job the guy came installed the app for me showed me how it works and everything uh, made sure I knew how to operate the cameras to rotate them to whatever angle that I want and they also installed the SD cards inside so this is like the daytime view I'm showing you guys how you can rotate um, the cameras they take I can literally see my entire neighborhood but I only focus to the cameras on our compound of course for privacy reasons so thank you so much TechFab definitely going to install your cameras indoors because these cameras are really awesome hey so I'm on my way to Kafo I uh, guess what I had forgotten to buy <laughs> For my son's birthday tomorrow, I had forgotten to buy snacks for the kids. Like, genuinely, I had forgotten. I remembered, like, last night. It's when it hit me. Oh my gosh, I need snacks for uh, kids. And kids are going to be me. Anyway, I'm heading to Kafo. And I'm wearing this uh, sweater dress that I got from MND. That shop is called what i forgot to tag it last time and i'm really sorry it's let me write it down here in case i forget um to tag it it's called m and m and d so cute shop 
one word m n d so cute shop one word on instagram and they think they're along kiambu road they have amazing amazing thrift dresses um i've actually ordered five more dresses from them um plus the other ones that i've been wearing to work okay, so this is how it um so this is how the sweater dress looks like really cute really comfortable i love her collection of thrift dresses and then i'm just wearing them with my red loafers that i got from backyard uh, So these are my son's outfits for the day so i just thought let me hang them so that it don't get creased so his birthday cake was made by baked by bells sorry it got a bit smudged because of the transportation all the way to shags so this is a chocolate orange flavor and she did such an amazing job highly highly recommend her the sugar balancing on this cake was awesome so i got this lovely package from rembesha essential which are hot pots i really wanted hot pots that are not the common silver ones that everyone has um so i got these ones from rembesha uh, essentials in pink i've seen it's Waidera and miss turu uh using them and they've given awesome awesome re reviews on them so i thought i should also grab myself one i, I need to get into this mama vibe <laughs> you know big hot pots and sufurias and everything so i really love that they were a bit unique not the usual gray ones um that everyone has but um they're a bit small so you can't serve like a huge gathering but just for your own family dinners and lunch and everything uh they're so awesome so i'll give you guys a more detailed review once i use them um but i really really love them thank you so much remember Sha essentials for this this is really lovely and they come in other colors i think two more colors gray and brown but knowing me i went with pink so as usual i will link their number in the description box their page in the description box in case you want to order so this is it for this video guys thank you so much for watching and i'll talk to you guys in my next video